Ah, uh, Mordhau. One of my favorite medieval fighting games to come out in a while. And currently one of my favorite games to play in my free time. There's just something about opening up into a fresh new game and finding out what new experiences wait inside. Wait a minute. Isn't there something else I love that's just like that? Oh yeah! Beer! That's right, this is a beer review. And the beer we're going to be reviewing today is... This is the beer we will be trying today from the Catawba Brewing Company. Honeycombed Honey Nut Breakfast Stout. This decadent, silky sweet dark ale features a virtual buffet of brunch-worthy specialty ingredients including wildflower honey, toasted hazelnuts, and milk sugar. It was then blended with a cold brewed Arabic coffee to complete this well-rounded embezzle. There's a couple of tasting notes and other facts right here, and it's got a very good alcohol by volume percentage with a 6.2. I like that in a beer. And this is a brand new beer that you can see featured on their website. And I recently just found it in the store, so I'm really excited to try it. Now this very clearly states that it is a breakfast stout. For me it is now 10 at night. Any real gamer knows that 10 o'clock at night is about the right time to wake up if you're an epic gamer. So I think this is going to be a perfect brew. Just top her off. Yeah. I'm really excited for this. This smells fantastic. This smells amazing. I got to be honest. So I'm really excited. Here we go. Wow. It's like Irish whiskey almost. Like, in what you would expect to be getting. That is really good. I feel like I'm at like a, like a breakfast bar at a hotel in the morning working like on a business trip you know what I mean just smell the coffee and the honey and the biscuits and everything we just got enough kick from last night's party to where you still feel nice inside yeah I wouldn't know what that's like I work for a restaurant oh man that's good this is a good beer. Now, I'm more of a lager guy. Because, if any of you know me, this is what I drink all the time. But, for a beer like this, this is sweet. I enjoyed this. I'll probably be getting this again, for sure. Catawba Brewing Company, you did a great job. If any of you also recommend this, if you're in the Carolinas, Go ahead and pick you up a can, bottle, whatever they're going to have it in, probably a can. Try it. It's pretty good. While searching for beers in my local store to pick, my wife actually pointed this one out because of my heritage. I'm actually a Catawba native, so getting the brewing company named after this was actually kind of neat. And I didn't notice it at first, but my wife did, thankfully. I'm really excited to look into a little bit of their history here, which you can find right here. Not do that. I don't want to butcher anybody's names, actually. Now I'm thinking about it, but you can see a lot of the history here, and definitely check out some of the beers. See, it's really interesting to see how these independent brewers have came about and just how much they do in these communities. They've definitely created plenty of jobs in their communities that stated right here to remain new brewers who have gone on and forged their own way into the industry. It's really nice to see that communities coming together over, you know, something that everybody kind of loves. That's sweet. It smells nice. It has a great bitter taste that's not, like, it's not one of those bitters that just, like, leaves you, like, ugh, the whole time. It, like, it's smooth. It's a nice, like, layer. It goes on, it, like, once it hits your tongue, it, like, spreads. 
and just like s has just a smooth transi transition down your esophagus, down to your stomach. It's really sweet. That is nice. I was very pleased with that. But that does it for this review. Please let me know what you guys thought about it. I would really enjoy doing this again. I got the, like, I didn't get this idea, but a friend of mine over at Grog Games, SP, he did a very similar thing, but his is going to be revolving around more than just beer. Mine will specifically be beer because I love beer. But go check out his review over on his channel. There'll be a link either in a card up here or in a link in the description down below to show him off because he's a very cool guy. He deserves some respect. So cheers to you guys. Let me know if you want more of this. And if you want me to bring a guest on or if you want to be a guest on this and have the same brew as me. I would love that. Just hit me up. Send me a message on Twitter. Follow me on Twitter. Alright guys. 